Hey guys, welcome back to our Let's Play Dragon Age Origins. <laughs> As you can see, we still have some dark spawn to kill. We have some pile of bones, pile of bones. So, you know what that means. I have to light as a feather. Go to Silent as a wind. I see nothing. Whatever was on the field is gone. Wasting your goddamn magic. Yes, I understand. So They'll never know what hit him. I'm going into your tactics and I'm gonna just like word more self clear. There. Save. Yes. There. Stop doing that. Time for a little cleanup. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
These creatures look a might have Show me what you've got. Only one shall come in. you wish. Let's get so started. We're mainly fighting these worm things. Turning in silverite, silverite rune. There's nothing here. Why would these things have money? I do not know. Darkspawn are at least kind of humanoid, so... I can kind of picture them with... You know, probably using the male... Crawling with filth. Typical.
some more. Are they dead? Oh. They all dead now. Well done. This should be easy enough. Okay, so now that they're all dead. As you wish. Dwarven war axe, we'll take that. Apparently we weren't the first. Silk carpet, diamond mall. You think the diamond wall would be made out of, I don't know, diamond? Now we loot the bodies. I have to loot the bodies On because it. I'm the only one capable of touching them. These are dark spawn and large chipped spirit. No. Uh. Yeah, we don't want to go in that. <laughs> to the shadows. Yeah, I'll target myself. As you wish. Less fighting, more dying. Blast you. Ah! Let's get started. Have at you. Explosives that I keep finding. All these acid flasks, these bombs and stuff. Right. Oh, two point five. Oh, yeah, I know it's there. I know that those are there. I'm uncertain what I hope to find here. Yeah, so we're gonna do that all over again. Yeah, I know, go through that whole thing again. Just be stick. Kurt! Some creatures. Why am I immediately? Now we get our hands. Everything's dead. We're taking everything that we find. Ooh. Dropped money. Huzzah. And uh, Shale's equipment's pretty much the best of we're gonna get. What is this? This. This I remember. It, 
It has dates and names. This is to honor those who volunteered, those who became golems. And, and there is my name, Shale of House Kadash. Just as Caradin said. I remember now, I remember Shale. That was me. You remember? That's wonderful. Wonderful to remember being a soft, squishy creature of flesh. Perhaps. I will need to think on these things I have learned. Perhaps I will speak to it of them soon. For now, let us carry on as we have. Yay! Ah. Well, I was hoping for like a plus three, but no. Well, wind time to level up your magic and your willpower. <laughs> mm. Let's see, glyph of warding, repulsion, neutralization. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Yeah. So. Back to camp. I don't know how long. Templars or warriors and rogues, basically non magic folk who are required to. What's going on with that bush? Alright. Let's talk with Sh Shale. I have a question for it if it will indulge me. It chose to side with Caradin and destroy the Anvil of the Void. I agree with its decision. And yet the Paragon Branca was the reason it ventured into the Deep Roads. Why did it choose to defy her? It could not have known for certain that Caradon would be able to assist it with the Dwarves. <laughs> you believe in Caradon? I wasn't going to let you down. I... I am pleased then. I had no idea that was why it did that. At any rate, I wanted to thank it. It gave Caradin the end he wanted, and I'm pleased to have been a part of it. I will have to think on Caradin's words to me. It was a great deal to absorb, but for now, let us go on. All right, Shale. Well, I think I'll cut it. I think I'll end it here, guys. So I will see you next time. Have fun. <laughs>